What is up, guys? My name is Animator here. What the hell is this? I'm just tell real quick. This is what if Naruto was in the Ombi, um, and this Naruto will be on team, um, the team of Kakashi, team Kakashi Ombi. Um, Kakashi will have three members. It wouldn't be Itachi Uchiha. Itachi will already master the clan and leave the village. And this, I'll give Naruto a powerful dojutsu. No, I'm joking. But Naruto will be friends or be friend of Karama, but not at this certain age you know of. Now, enjoy this video. Naruto is at the age of two in a prodigy. He can read and write and walk on his own two legs. Naruto was a prodigy of anyone, of children. Naruto was a prodigy. While the third Hokage who is watching over Naruto, he can see Naruto can walk and read. Cause he get, Naruto got one of the third Hokage's books in his drawer. And Naruto started reading it silently. And Naruto was happy that he can read and write. Now, years passed and Naruto was at the age of four. Train, he was training real hard to be stronger, to be like someone that can someone who can fear him who fears him not who gonna be come the next shadow hokage if you can know what i mean like danzo is the shadow hokage who do what the hokage don't want to do yes but Naruto would do it differently now years another year passes not to age of five and got put in the ombu. Actually, Donzo kidnapped Naruto and told Naruto to fight the two Uchiha's. These two Uchiha's was above him. These two Uchiha's was eight years old. Why Naruto was 95? Naruto had his double blades. One katana and one like small big sword that was on his left side. Naruto agreed with this fight. And Naruto was facing off with two Uchiha's and Naruto noticed the Sharingan. The Sharingan was for three Tomo. So Naruto vanished in a burst of speed, taking off taking them both off. Naruto off guard. Naruto was off guard because he's only one person taking care of two shinobis. Naruto was rushing towards him while the two Uchiha's blocked their Naruto's move because they now know what Naruto was gonna do. Naruto had to use Chakra Nature's his wind style. Wind style. Heaven slash, Naruto said, trying to kill one of the shinobis. They easily dodged this and rushed towards Naruto, giving Naruto a large gaping slash on his arm. Naruto held his arm and put his la put his katana back in the sheath and then pulled out his large small blade. Naruto rushed towards the two ombus. And uh, seeing his hand, his arm get healed, he's ready for action. Naruto rushed home with blink speed, cutting some of the arm boots. And Naruto had to run off, sealing his presence better than any ninja, and not better than Kakashi. But no one, either, not even Danzo, can seal his presence like that. Naruto sealed his presence while Danzo went after him, but it was too late. Danzo couldn't sense Naruto, so Danzo left. Mm -hmm. Danzo went back and told the eight-year-old Uchiha's to go find Naruto and bring him back safe. Bring him back now. The two Uchiha's that was in the arm of Danzo said, "Yes, sir." With no emotions on their face, they rushed off. We skipped to Naruto bumping into the third Kage, telling the third Kage is two Ambus trying to kill him. The third Kage said, "Okay, I will protect you." But Naruto wanted to try to fight him by himself. Hokage sama and Naruto said, Can I fight him by myself? If I can't, well, I'm useless. The Hokage agreed with this. Naruto used chakra to jump on the building. The Hokage was surprised that Naruto can jump on there. Naruto now looked at looked at the people, the two Ambus coming toward him. And the Okage knows it was to Chihas. Since in her presence, he can easily smile. The Okage gave Naruto a smile with 
gratitude, Naruto rushed towards the two Ambus. The two Ambus pulled out their sheaths and blades and pulled out katanas. Naruto put sheathed his katanas and his small blade inside of his sheath. Naruto pulled out four kunas and four shuriken. Naruto closed his eyes and jumped up high with a backflip, closing his eyes and opening it, showing nothing. Showing just a dark present, showing his eyes with red. Some of the chakra of the nine tails was pointing out of Naruto. That's why Naruto's eyes was red. Naruto threw the kunais and the shuriken, making the kunais bump the shuriken, hitting the ombu. The ombus couldn't easily dodge the shuriken or the kunais that easy. They dodged. They dodged the shuriken. They dodged only four shurikens and the, um, one shuriken hit him on the arm. Naruto rushed towards one Uchiha that was right there. Naruto slashed a slash to the men's to the boy's chest, killing him instantly. The boy went down on the ground dead. Naruto looked with his gnarled eyes and gnarled. His, he gnarled his eyes at one last person, the Uchiha, with greater intent. The Uchiha picks up the boy's sword that died and rushed towards Naruto with, with bloodlust. Naruto did the same with a clash. A king sound was why the Hokage was looking up. The Hokage seen Naruto killing, kill the eight-year-old Uchiha, so the Hokage had to intervene. The Okage jumped up and blocked the sword that was coming from the Anbu and Naruto, telling them to, to stop. The Okage called in two Anbus to grab the dead body of, of the Naruto who killed the eight-year-old Uchiha, and the Okage told them to punish the, this Anbu for attacking Naruto's Amaki. The Ambus agreed, and six-year-old Naruto is now trained. He trains with his swords. His swords are strong, and his muscle builds not that too strong. But in this, Naruto will have an impact and a little bit of muscle on his bones. Naruto will eat healthy, stronger than some Chiyas. Naruto was called in from the Okage. The Okage called it Naruto. Naruto, I want you to train, and then you'll be going on missions with this team. Naruto looked down and seen the names Kakashi, Team Kakashi. Yes, Okage sama. Here, the Okage gave Naruto some gear. Naruto had a long black. Naruto had a long black sleeve shirt and with armor of the Ambus. Naruto had a cat mask with whisker mugs in a swirling a swirling village for the whirlpools. To know that he is a Maki. Naruto trains in Kenjutsu, Ninjutsu and Genjutsu. Naruto um taught himself and taught him lightning release. Black Lightning of the five, Fifth Reich Hake. But this Black Lightning turned to blue. No, I will say this. For not copying no one else's video, I will say this. Naruto will use. He learned, taught himself black. No. Yellow Lightning coming from his body is just like the Reich Hake, but much stronger. I will be right back sooner or later. Sorry for that. Let's get back into the video. Be quiet! Sorry for that last night. Naruto had now trained. The old cocky gives Naruto the orders to train every day when he heats the 12 to another year. Naruto trains to another year. Naruto is still 7 years old now. 
And Naruto came back to the Hokage with his mask on. Naruto said, Lord Hokage, did you call? He said, yes, go to this warehouse where the two, the captain of the Uchiha, the captain Kakashi Hatake, the captain of the Ombu. Naruto looked at the um, name and said, yes, Hokage. Naruto vanished in a poof of smoke. Body flingering there, rushing towards where the Hokage sent him to do. Naruto appeared in the warehouse where the strongest ombuts arrived, where the Hokage ombuts always stay in that. The Hokage ombuts was up in there. Naruto opens the door, and some ombuts was playing some training with another ombu. Be quiet! For fuck's sakes. Sorry. Naruto now looked over and seen a man with grayish hair, with silver hair, with silver hair, and looks like a normal, looks like a masked guy. Naruto walks over, asking him, are you Kakashi Hatake? He said yes, in a deeper meaning of tone. Why? The Okake sent me to be one of your team members. Well, the two Ambu that was in Kakashi Hatake's team looked over and told him that you don't, you look like you're weak. You can't handle no one else. Fight us before you be on this team. Well, Naruto did so easy and pulling out his two katanas. Actually, his katana and his black and his silver small katana blade, which I'm explaining this blade. The blade um, identifies a white substance that's appearing off of it, but that white substance was turning red into Karama's chakra. So Naruto pushed a lot of Karama's chakra inside of the sword. Naruto didn't know what kind of chakra he was holding inside of his body, but he still holds the chakra of Karama. Naruto pushed a little bit of Karama's chakra into that small blade. That blade is a small um, blade and big. It's a big small blade. Naruto put it out and to the two Ombus laughed. Why do you have a small blade in a katana? Naruto smiled, giving them katanas, a, giving the two Ombus a smirk, but they didn't see the smirk. So Naruto said, are you ready? With a deeper meaning and trustworthy. Naruto vanished. In a blink of an eye, he appeared by the two Ombus holding his small blade to the ombu with black hair neck and holding the katana to the blonde hair girl I mean the blonde hair boy to his throat now I win Naruto said but the two ombu smirked under their mask kicking Naruto away at the same time Naruto jumped back before he get kicked Naruto closed his eyes and opened them, showing the red eyes of the nine-tailed beast. Girl. Kakashi notices and seeing he got a little bit of control of the nine-tailed beast. Naruto, he remembered the name Naruto Zamaki, and he remembered watching over him. Well, that's Naruto Zamaki the last. Jerk. Oh, okay. Well, Naruto faced off with the two Ombus clashing to him in a slice. Naruto went for a large slice to both of the Ombu's chests and it made it in. Colliding with the Ombu's chest, they went flying back with a little bit of wind pressure towards the swords. Naruto chuckles in his mind. Well, I went, so that means I give to join you. Kakashi Hatake, leader of Kakashi team. The Kakashi said yes, you get to join me now. Let's go. They did they did a A rank mission. They have to face off one thousand rock shinobis that was coming towards a leaf. And uh, face off with the Lord of the What's his name? I will be right back into so I can get the man's name. I will be right back.
now, now I know the five rock shinobis in the Mizukage. I think the fourth Mizukage, the Uchi, the Jinjuriki, I really don't know. But yeah, the fourth Mizukage, eh, eh, the rock shinobis, one, 1,000 rock shinobis going towards the lead. But four Anbus, even Kakashi and Naruto set their presence. Kakashi said, get ready, go. The two Anbus that Naruto faced off earlier, and Naruto went off with a slash, killing s half of the, um, half of the, um, Rock Shinobis. Kakashi didn't want to get beat by a little kid, so he used his blade and forced it with a lightning chakra, killing all of them in one slash, making his blade get much stronger of lightning release. Naruto chuckled in his mind, seeing Kakashi kill all the shinobis in one slash. That's why they call. That's huh? That's why they call him Kakashi Hateke of Light of the Sharingan. Naruto chuckled to himself. Since, um, um, what you call the leader? Let's go, Naruto said. But then heard some more rock shinobis in uh, the Mizukage of the of the Mizukage. Naruto noticed the Jinjuriki, the three tailed Jinjuriki. Is that what's the three tails? I don't know. The Mizukage. Naruto noticed a biju bomb was going to hit his sen his um his um thing, and then the biju bomb went towards Kakashi and really burned Kakashi a lot on his skin. He was burning. This is when Naruto got pissed and went towards the Mizukage, <coughs> starting tassel and fight around and letting out a large amount of bloodlust. And then Kuro Chaka went all around Naruto's body with four cloaks around him. Naruto rushed towards the Mizukage. In blink of an eye, Naruto kicked the Mizukage flying back. While the Mizukage using a biju bomb, hitting Naruto, making him flying back, crashing into a tree. Naruto said, Ultimate Lightning Style Biju Bomb Attack. A biju bomb entranced towards a lightning. Combined those biju bomb and lightning release going towards the right the Mizukage. Naruto went towards it and shot it off to the Mizukage. The Mizukage let off a bit roar, letting off another biju bomb but bigger than the lightning bomb, and exploded on impact, making the Mizukage retreat. Naruto was huffing and puffing under his mask. Cause he's almost out of chakra. He fell to his two knees and his eyes starting to close away. Well, shutting down for a little bit. Naruto's eyes shut, making sure he's tired. Naruto went to sleep while Kakashi came down there and grabbed Naruto. Knowing that Naruto's like a little bit damaged by using the Naruto's chakra and Finding off the Mizukage, the strongest, the Jinjuriki of the Kakes. Well, now, Naruto, Kakashi, and the two teammates of the Apu went up. Uh, they did 1,100 D rank missions. 1,100 D rank missions. I mean, C rank. 400 A rank missions, 100 B rank missions. Two S rank missions. Now it's the third S rank mission. Naruto was gonna be 12 years old, but he's still 11 years old. Naruto was 11 years old, and they went on a last S rank mission for a tired year. The S rank mission was gonna be a year old. Now this one, the Chia clan will be getting massacred. Now Naruto went off like Kakashi did. <sighs> They went off to meet, and Naruto was named the Shadow of Death. Yes, his name is the Shadow of Death. And I'm gonna say this is probably gonna be a movie. It's 10:59 p.m. 
know what, I'm gonna make it a movie because I never did it what earlier. So, Naruto was off with Kakashi and the two teammates that Naruto had. Naruto, Kakashi, and his two teammates went off on on a one-year training trip and killing a bunch of ninjas on the way. Some rogue shinobis that was from the leaf was now dead. Six feet deep. Now, Naruto, Kakashi, and the two members on the team of Team Kakashi was facing off with a powerful ninja. ninja. This ninja was t wearing a Similar mask as Naruto, wearing ombu clothing, where with a black long sword, and kosa and black lightning, and it, it had a headband on his right arm, saying, "The cloud." Naruto chuckled. Kakashi. Naruto called Kakashi, and Kakashi looked back. Kakashi, can you handle this? Kakashi nodded his hand, and that Kakashi was much, much, much stronger in canon. He was much, much stronger in this video. So in canon, he was not that strong. But in this, Kakashi Sharingan was much powerful, and he can use much more genjutsu. And Kakashi Sharingan reached the Mangekyo. Now, enjoy. Kakashi was facing off with the Cloud Ninja from the Ombu. Kakashi asked the Cloud Ninja, "What is he doing? What is he doing here near the Fire Country?" And they said he didn't say nothing, but looked around, sensing more Cloud Shinobis. But Naruto or Kakashi or the two members of Kakashi's team never sensed them. When the man put his, pulled up his blade, five ninjas wearing the same exact mask as the man using black lightning release. Kakashi's eyes widened. Naruto, Gemachuto. I, I'm just saying the name. Naruto looked behind him, seeing the Angus that was wearing the same mask and that was supposed to be on their team. Naruto noticed something. He noticed something weird about those zombies. Naruto went towards them with a slash. They could, they would have dodged, but they stand right there. Where's those two? Naruto said to Kakashi. Kakashi looked behind him, seeing the two zombies now gone. What happened? Did you kill them, Naruto? No, it was just clones. What clones? Naruto looked around and pulled out a lot of chakra. Forcing a lot of chakra around the supremacy. Naruto sensed the two Ombus was chained up somewhere far to the north, all the way to the fire country. Kakashi, they're chained up to the north, far to the fire country, almost close to the fire daimyo. Alright, let's deal with these ninjas and go off them. Yes, sir. Naruto vanished in a large lightning style. Lightning style. Yellow flames, lightning style, yellow lightning. A large burst of lightning went over Naruto, body and swords. Naruto rushed towards the Ombus and attacked them at one will, killing four Ombus. When White Kakashi was facing off with two Ombus, the leader of the Ombu, and the Ombu that was watching over the leader. It was six Ombus together, lightning style. Black wave. A large, a large amount of lightning went towards Kakashi. Lightning shout, Shidori. Kakashi rushed over with his hand, his right hand, Shidori, with a blue. I would say this, a lighter blue shade of Kakashi's lightning style, Shidori. He pierced the man who was losing black wave, killing him instantly, killing him in the heart. Naruto seen this and closed his eye. Fire style. Fire style. Fireball jutsu, he said. And he clashed to the man who was having black lightning stronger than the five Ombus beside him. The man said, well, I'm not going to die without a fight. The man sticked his sword into the ground and said, lightning style. 
shock absorption. Exhort people's chakra from electrocuting them for distancing. Nato tried to jump away and he fell to the ground, sensing his chakra going away and seeing blue, a little bit of blue chakra going towards the man. Thank you, the man said. With a slash, he almost killed Naruto. Naruto's eyes went red. Oh, lightning style, Naruto said. <laughs> oh, black thunder, Naruto said. Raising up his hand, and I watched lightning strikes the man. But the man jumped out of the way, and he instantly dodged. Naruto's eyes was going to shut. But Kurama forced a little bit of more chakra, making sure the boy don't die. I'm not gonna die. Kurama. Kurama choked in his mind, making sure the boy was knowing that he has a friend. Naruto went unconscious for that. Kakashi was angry, badly pissed for him, not protecting his own teammate, his comrades. He remembered what Obuto said. If you break the rules, you're a scum, but if you don't protect your, uh, if you abandon your comments and win friends, you're worse than scum. Kakashi was just ringing that in his head. Lightning style, dragon thunder, Kakashi said. A large bunch of lightning crashed down to the black lightning guy. Killed him instantly. Kakashi picked up Naruto and went off to go grab his other weak, pathetic teammates of his. And the teammate was already killed by the Ambu. The Ambu, the two Ambus killed the teammates that Kakashi and Naruto had. And they went back to the Cloud Ninja. The Cloud. Back to the Ninja Cloud Shinobi. Back to the sixth grade nature. The Cloud. The Cloud. The Cloud. Back to the Cloud. Um. Back to the Cloud Village. The hidden of the cloud. While Naruto was sh shaking in his mind, seeing what Kurama saying. <laughs> now, we skip years past. Naruto is now at the age of 12, and he had to go towards the third Kage, and the third Kage told Naruto to take off his mask. Naruto did so, and he stood up. Okage sama, he said. You will be on Team 7 with Kakashi Hatsuke. You are sensei, after all. You was trained by him, after all. Naruto said, yes, who else? Sakura Harune, Sasuke Uchiha. Your goal is to train Sasuke so he can get powerful. That is it. You do not have to protect him, but you still have to train him. Yes, Hokage, Naruto said. Alright, Naruto left his gear by the Hokage's desk and vanished in a poof of smoke. Naruto inside the academy becomes a dead last, but still passed with great skill. Naruto was put on Team 7. Naruto was talking, but he wasn't talking at all, but waiting for his sensei. He was waiting patiently. While Kakashi came in, he seen the red, the dark death. The dark demon, I would say. The shadow demon. Yeah, I said that. What is the shadow demon here? Hmm. That's weird. When Naruto looked at Kakashi. And gave Kakashi a smile. Hey, Kakashi sensei, Naruto said. Sakura and Sasuke looked for like weirded out that Naruto seen noticed his sensei and name. Maybe to the roof. They did so. What is your likes, dislikes, and dream goals? You. My goal is to kill the certain summer. Re restore my clan. And. I don't like. I don't like people at all. I don't. I don't even. I dislike some people. Now, yours. Sakura was as canon, just as Sasuke. Naruto, yours? I'm Naruto Zomaki. I don't have no like. I don't have dislikes. Or I don't have a dream or a goal. Gagashi already know Naruto wouldn't have that. 
because she'd been in the army for years, as she was a child, of course. Now, until now, looked at Kakashi. Well then, I will have a belt as. And Kakashi looked at Naruto, and poof and smoke, telling everyone to not eat. But he noticed Naruto. And then he not to put the smoke in well only Kakashi. And told Kakashi his mission to train Sasuke Uchiha and make him become true Nin. Kakashi said okay. But do not be an about us. Not to said agree. I will be training then. Alright. Now the day of the bell test as Gokete. But Naruto told Sakura and Sasuke that they have to train together. They have to stick together to get the bells. Then they did so, and they won. Then Kakashi said, I already passed Naruto. He showed me his skills. Now, you all pass. Welcome to Team 7. You know what? This is, won't be a movie. Be a movie. Because this has have to be a part one and part two because I need to make uh it's eleven it's eleven and eleven. It's eleven eleven PM in the middle of night man. Well, I'm sorry. But let's get back into the story. They was doing Kakashi said we got the one to do a serious mission. Naruto didn't Naruto didn't care. They went to the Hokage's tower uh, mansion the Hokage's mansion and office. Open in the door and ask the Hokage you called. Yes, Team 7 was ordered to get a Siri mission to protect a bridge builder named Tazana. Tazana came in drunk and stared at everyone, called them useless and called them pathetic. Naruto didn't do anything but anything but sat back and relaxed. We skipped to Naruto killing the team, the twin brothers, the Chunin brothers. Naruto threw three kids. Three shuriken and kunai up in the air, piercing the tuning brothers in their chest. Naruto disappeared in a black, in a black mist or black water or substance, and appeared behind the tuning brothers. When no remorse killed them instantly. Naruto asked Gushi, "Can we go back?" But Naruto stopped Tazuna and told him, "This is not a mission, but we still will protect him." Naruto said, "Before we keep on, before we go on, what? Who's coming after you, Zabuza? I mean, Ta Tazuna. A man called Gato, sending ninjas after ninjas, was coming after me because uh, if I build that bridge, not to stop him right there. If you build that bridge, that means he will lose all money, all fame, and he have he have to kill you, sending Abus." Or sending people to kill you if they don't succeed, and you succeed building that bridge, you will he will lose all his money, his fame, and have to try and try to make more money. Got Zabuza, I mean Tazanus agreed with this. As Ganon, they was facing off with Haku and Zabuza. Naruto had to see Sasuke and Sa Sasuke was going in to fight Haku. This Haku it was still a boy, so Naruto and Haku Haku noticed the name, the Shadow Demon, or the Dark Shadow. I don't know, the Demon Shadow. Demon Del Bro, that's a that's an anime. The Demon Shadow, folks. No, the Demon Swords. I don't. I think that's. They, Naruto was the um, Mist Demon, yes. He called himself the Mist Demon. It was all around the world. Naruto vanished in a think of an eye, kicking the ice one of the ice mirrors, using full force of Karam's chakra, breaking one. As can as Sasuke gets pierced in every vital organs, and not vital organs like killing him, but he was knocked unconscious. Naruto checks Sasuke's pulse and knowing he's not alive. But Naruto didn't get angry, seeing his chakra pulse is just only low. So Naruto looked at the Iceman and vanished in a blink of an eye, 
breaking all the ice mirrors and knocking out Haku, not killing him. Because Naruto was thinking of Haku being a nice, not weapon, but good teammate. Naruto seen Gato, telling Gato, um, G telling Zabuza Gato was going to betray you. But Naruto said, Kakashi, don't be cocky now. Finish him or kill him. Knock him out or kill him. Kill him now or save him. Each one, Naruto said, picking up Haku and Kakasasuke, bringing him back to Sasano. Naruto looked down at both of them and used green substance came out of Naruto's hand, healing both of them. Was now tr they was both healed, and uh, they was still unconscious. So Kakashi did one thing: killing Zabuza. Not to see Gato's men, even Gato himself, and then Kakashi and Naruto killed them all with one slash, called the Yellow Lightning. And Kakashi used his lightning blue lightning. Roasted are all around his body, and Naruto did the same. They both rushed at all the uh, Gato's men and killed them in one single second. In five seconds, they're dropped dead. Now, Tosuna finished building the bridge, and in, in like a month or so, in two months, he finished building the bridge. Naruto, Kakashi, Team Seven, and Haku. Haku now joins Team Seven, and went off with Uzumaki Naruto. Now, I'll be ending off here. I will be saying this. Naruto Kakashi will be training Sasuke and Kenjutsu and training Sakura as well. Because in this, they will not leave Sakura out of this. And Kakashi will train Sakura in a little bit of Genjutsu. And I was, he will see how, what kind of release Sakura got. So, the training commence. Peace out, anime fans. The anime chat out. Before I leave, I hope you like and subscribe. And... Enjoy this whatever. And part two, give me up to five likes and part two will be out not today but tomorrow. Peace, love you all, and goodbye.